Hello everyone. This video is about designing sidebar header with Elementor Face Builder or Elementor Website Builder. Yeah, most of the conventional or traditional, yeah, uh, common uh, website headers are here in the top of the website. But sometimes you will find website headers on the left side, yeah, or the right side, uh, mostly on the left side here, like this. This is the website header I designed uh, a demo with Elementor. Uh, it can be done with Elementor Pro or Elementor Free. If you want to design this in Elementor Free, then you have to yeah, uh, install some third-party plugins, third-party add-ons for Elementor like uh, Anywhere Elementor and, and uh, Master add-ons for Elementor or header footer blocks by Brainstorm Force. Yeah. So you have to choose among the two add-ons for building a header with Elementor free and for using shortcuts anywhere Elementor you need it for free Elementor. In Elementor Pro you do not need those add-ons but you can design it this sidebar. Okay let me show you from this start. Let's go to the dashboard. Now Here, let's then disable these plugins. And uh, then just deactivate this master add-ons. These plugins will be needed for the my next video. In my next video, I will show you how to design this same thing with free version of what uh, uh, Elementor. And here in this video, let's do with Elementor Pro. Now let's go to here in the templates. Now let's add new. This is a simple section template for your, yeah, inserting in the header. Now let's call it sidebar header template. Create the template. Okay, now here. Let's create this template. Yeah, you can add about yes, a single column, single column, and in the page setting, yeah, in the page. Okay, in the section setting. Yeah, for this section setting, uh, full white. Okay. A column gap, no gap in the advanced. Okay, let's leave it for now in the background. Add some background color, maybe back black like this. Okay, and let's add some bearings about 20 at the top, 50 at the left and about 100 at the bottom 50 at the right something like this and the section height yeah let's make it fit to screen like this and column position top like this now the first let's put logo side logo top at the top okay and the second point, we can put search something like search, search form or something like this. You can customize it according to your needs. For now, let's put the, just the structure and do it. Now, let's put menu, navigation, navbar, yeah, like this. Choose vertical, sorry, vertical, like this. Yeah. 
you got the point you can yeah design beautiful design by increasing the uh, gap between these menus and all but you can customize it now now we have put all the structures we need publish this and let's go back into the dashboard templates now this is the sidebar header template copy this short code copy it now add another new template header template this is sidebar header get template Now, okay, full white, no gap. Okay, and in this uh, shortcut in the left side column, let's insert a shortcut that we have copied like this yeah now you got a point and let's go to the advanced section positioning positioning fix okay we want to position this uh, column shortcut fix on the left side okay and the white custom pixel about 300 pixel on the left side like this yeah publish this it can listen entire website okay seven close now let's go to the front page here oh, sorry here okay. yeah you got a point here yes you can see now our left side uh, <laughs> left sidebar header is ready <laughs> yeah you can put uh, on the right side too no problem you can yeah put this on the right column yeah you can drag this shortcut on the right side like this and update refresh it sorry so you have to yeah, go to the fix positioning yeah you have to uh, go up. yeah you have to adjust here or the orientation right like this Update. Yeah. Now, now the left sidebar header is on the right side. It's quite easy. First, you have to design a section template, uh, designing your header part, and copy that temp template shortcut and insert in your header uh, header <laughs> template. Why we need uh, this two step because uh, as I have mentioned in before in the column in column we do not have positioning option here it is this is shortcut widget not a column we are yeah this positioning feature of Elementor is not available for yeah so columns or sections it's only available in the widgets so we have to use the, the uh, uh, positioning feature of the shortcut widget and that's why we put the widget shortcut and insert the template inside the shortcut widget like this it's quite convenient yeah now you can design according to your needs uh, I'm sure quite sure that yeah, yeah, yeah. your creativity your imagination is quite good 
and you will be able to design a beautiful sidebar header using this available tools and plugins you can put phone number email social icons menus search icon or anything in here on the sidebar because this is a fixed sidebar so yeah it's quite convenient yeah it's quite easy to design this uh, sidebar header with Elementor Pro or free it's quite easy and this is possible with uh, the feature called this positioning yeah, this positioning feature because of this quite feature without it we can do it with custom CSS but uh, that's very trouble something custom CSS we can do it we can accept this feature without this positioning um, with custom CSS but uh, quite troublesome if you want to know about the custom CSS uh, how to achieve this uh, how to design this header with custom CSS then you leave a comment below I will make a video about that but without the custom CSS we can accept this with Elementor Pro or Elementor Free with the available features and add-ons why not why go to, to why go all the troubles if we can accept this easily with the available tools that's the point i hope this video is helpful to you for all those beginners and pros and uh, yeah i think this is i think this is quite good uh, trick to design uh, sidebar header with elementor if you like this video and find it helpful please click the thumbs up button and subscribe my youtube channel if you have not and don't forget to click the notification bell to let this updates.